Hi, I'm Yaya Lu. I'm soon to be a grade 10 student at Ogilvy High School. When a paraplegic is shopping in a supermarket, he or she needs two hands to control the wheelchair and two hands to control the shopping trolley. That seems quite impractical. So I thought that a shopping trolley which automatically followed the wheelchair would be a big help to the paraplegic. This is my new robot shopping trolley. Um, give you a 360 degree view. So, looks something like this. It's a bit difficult to hold. Sorry. Yeah. So, this is what it looks like, and you'll notice at the back there's a multi directional wheel. This helps it um, move sideways and increase it the ability to move. And as you'll notice, here is the where you put the groceries, groceries. And in the official thing, obviously there will be a sides and a floor or bottom. But um, this is just a prototype, so this is just used for testing. So yep, this is what it looks like. I then put a high technic soccer ball onto the back of my wheelchair to act as a target, and used a high technic IR seeker to allow the shopping trolley to find the wheelchair. I am also controlling the wheelchair using voice command in NXTB radio, as stated in my other videos. This is our paraplegic bear sitting in her wheelchair. She can take groceries from the low shelves and place them in her new robotic shopping trolley. Now, to get groceries from the high shelves, all she needs to do is raise the chair. This new high position also doubles up as a method for the paraplegic to talk to others face to face. Now, let us lower the wheelchair to the travelling position, or the lowest position, and start the robot shopping trolley and move the wheelchair forwards to see if the tro shopping trolley can robotically follow. Following the chair from behind seems okay, but what happens if the wheelchair is at right angles to the shopping trolley? This sort of thing could happen at the end of a supermarket aisle. The most difficult case would possibly be when the chair is facing the opposite direction, parallel to it. When tested, this was the result. So following the wheelchair seems to work okay, and I'm quite happy with the result of my first attempt at a robotics shopping trolley.